in what you are and say what you feel because those who mind don't matter and those who matter don't mind said Dr. Seal. A very good afternoon and a heartily welcome to our respected principal Reverend Father Marcos de Souza, respected headmistress Sister Luisa de Souza. Honorable judges, teachers, all the participants and my dear friends. Repetition is the art of delivering your views and thoughts with expression in a limited period of time. Many students and in that manner, even the adults hesitate to speak in front of the audience. It includes a lot of courage and confidence to be a good speaker. In our active school, we give such opportunities to the students to display their talents. And one such opportunity is given by conducting elevation operations. Before we begin this competition, let me take the pleasure to welcome our principal and the headmistress with our rose as a token of love. Hey! 
sister, teachers, and my dear friends. My name is Shubh J. J. I am from 5th A class. Today I am going to speak about the national leader I adore the most. The national leader I like the most. There have been many leaders who lead this world differently. Some work for social reforms, while many work for social awareness. Several of them work for upliftment of societies. But I admire the most is the Missile Man of India. Any guesses who is the Missile Man of India? Very good. Dr. APJ Abdul Karam. He was one of the best example how should a leader be. He was one of the sparkling figure of India. He has contributed a lot for development of our India. During his childhood, he used to sell newspaper from door to door and permanent seats in the market to earn some extra money for his family. At that time, he was 8 years old. Can you believe that? 8 years old? But later he became scientist and served India as 11th president of the nation. He was born on 15th October 1931 in the temple town of Rameshwaram in Tamil Nadu. He comes from an humble background. His father Jayamuladhi who was an imam at local mosque. On the other hand, his brother Ashrama was a simple housewife. In 1958, he joined DRDO, Defense Research and Development Organization. And as a scientist, and later he shifted himself into ISRO, India's first satellite launching vehicle, SLV-3, as a result of his utmost sacrifice and dedicated work. He tries his India's superpower in the field of science and technology. His vision, thoughts and goals have inspired millions of Indians. His focus was always being one to transform India into a developed nation. We lost this great scientist on 27 July 2015. His absence will be always felt in our country. I love APJ Abdul Kalam sir. I want to be a little bit like him. Was 
his right from his young age. He is a great admirer of Swami Vivekananda. He always emphasizes coming age is the age of knowledge. However, rich, poor, or powerful a country be, if they want to move ahead, only knowledge can lead them to that path. Narendra Modi is a motivation for every Indian. He has become the Prime Minister of India after breaking the bar of poverty strike and tea selling boy. He has seamlessly become a development oriented leader. He is a prominent figure who showed us success is not related to caste system. It doesn't matter where a person belongs to. Narendra Modi is considered a master strategist and becomes a ray of hope for billions.
my heart for gratitude to our beautiful and charming judges for accepting the invitation to judge this competition. Thank you teachers for your valuable time and may God always bless you. A special thank you to all the participants for all the confidence and the preparation they have put in to deliver their speeches. Continue doing the same in future. A big thank you to all the students for being very patient listeners and for being a good audience throughout the competition. As the results are ready, I request both the judges to come forward and announce the results. Teacher Valentina will announce the winners of Standard 4 and Teacher Asentina will announce Children, you have really done well. Now I request teacher Valentina to declare the results of standard 4. Winners of standard 4, first, Master Janmesh Dalvi, 4th C, 93 points. Second, Master Dev Malekar, 4th A, 78 points. Third, Miss Dipti Tiwari, 4th C, 74 points. Friends, congratulating all the participants. You spoke very well and it was a very tough job for me to judge your uh, speeches. So, any guesses? First prize? The first prize goes to Master Johan Subash. 50, 96 points. Second place, Master Shub Jain, 5th age, 92 points. Third place, Master Sumit Pal, 5th age, 89 points. Thank you.